This is dreams we're talking about. We're talking about dreams. So many people are asking me like how, how do I live my dream Gary and you know I don't have time. I have mortgages and bills and responsibilities in my job. I don't have time for my side hustle, my Twitch channel, my Instagram account, my Shopify store selling hoodies and I keep getting to this new place which is talk to me about your bills. Like why'd you buy an apartment that stretches you? Why is your car so fancy? Like, why do you need the new Gucci every time? Like, why are you why are you going out Thursday, Friday, and Saturday night? Like, why are you going to Coachella? Like, why why are you going to Avengers opening night and buying the biggest piece of popcorn and candy? Like, the answer to all of your questions is not how much money you make or how much time you have. It's what you're spending your money on. Why do you want the newest pair of Yeezys? Why? Why? entitled to your dream. You're not entitled. Nobody's entitled to be a, an amazing dancer. Nobody that, that tours the world and gets to dance and open for Beyonce and make 580 a year and fucking live it and go to fucking, you know, you know <laughs> Monaco on the fucking weekends. Like, it's not how it works. Everybody starts at zero. Some people start at different places. But anybody who does it for themselves has to sacrifice. Like, yes, like, move. Like, my city's expensive, move. Like, my car payments are high. Sell your car and buy a piece of shit car. Take the bus. This is dreams we're talking about. We're talking about dreams. We're talking about, like, I want to be a professional gamer. We're talking about, I want to get paid $200,000 to give a speech. We're talking about shit that isn't normal. Dreams require sacrifices. People don't want to sacrifice. Like some reason, DNA, parenting, circumstance, I'm on the extreme end of everything's my fault. Nobody owes me shit. I shouldn't get anything unless I bleed for it. It's one big framework, DRock, of like, of self-esteem, lack of self-esteem, slash insecurity, entitlement, or accountability. It's these huge things. I'm not judging people other than I'm asking people and I'm bringing up a different debate that isn't being talked about a lot, which is why do you want to go to Coachella? That's what I'm interested in.